Hello ladies and gentlemen, it's Mike here at Game From Scratch, and this video is brought to you by the Unity Asset Store who just launched their Black Friday sale. So as of today, you can get 500 items 50% off, but it gets so much better than that. They also have 24-hour flash deals, and they've learned from the mistakes of the past. These flash deals are actually all being announced in advance. There is no limits on them, so as many people can buy them as they want. So basically for each day in the schedule, you can get these items for up to 70% off. On top of 500 50% off items, but to make it even better, if you use the code GAMEFROMSCRATCHBF22, you get an additional 10% off. So use that at checkout. It'll knock 10% off the 70% off potentially uh, of all the items that you are buying. That's the first time ever that you've been able to use a code on a sale item. So you can get up to 80% off here if you buy $100 worth of items or more. So let us take a look at the uh, flash deals as they are being announced. So again, there's 500 items here for 50% off and all of the flash deals aren't in that 50% off sale. So you don't have to worry if there's something that's 50% off, it's not going to come up on sale at 70% off. So just go ahead and pick it up if it's a good deal to you. And you're going to see the first day here, we have these five items. I'm going to cover all of them in detail in this video a little bit later on. So timestamps are down below. So if you want to know about flat kit, the big, big castle kit, the Atavism X6 world building bundle, or the Polygon Apocalypse Pack. I'm going to do a quick hands-on with each one of those, but you're going to see here the next day. So on Tuesday, you're going to see these two start, and this is another Cinti Pack, and then the RPG Essentials Kit. And you can see on Wednesday, you've got this pack. So each one of these, you've got an entire roadmap of how this is going to work. Most days, two new assets being added, but then you're going to notice on Friday itself, you're getting a number of new assets added in. So here you see in seven days, seven days, seven days, seven days, seven days. So that day has five assets added in, and you can see all the way out through the life of the sale in advance what every single asset is actually going to be. So you know in advance what all of the deals are going to be 70% off. So you can't, you know, you're not going to miss out on this. There's not a FOMO here. You know what it is. You're not competing with other people. You don't have to get up at an early time zone or anything weird like that. Literally the entire roadmap of the deals is already available to you. I like this approach. This is a much better thing. And then once again, if you use the code game from scratch, BF22, you can save an additional 10% off orders of $100. There are 500 items 50% off. I'm technically recording this before the sale starts, so I can't show you that list, but you can jump in and take a look at all of the flash deals that are going to come at 70% off. So I really like this new format. I know a lot of people were like really frustrated with the way they set up these flash deals in the past. So let me know in the comments if you like this approach better. Now let's take a look at the first day's assets. Help you decide if any of these look good to you. Our first asset is Flat Kit, Tune Shading and Water. This one is pretty straightforward in what it does. If you want to get that stylistic, uh, flat shaded look, uh, this provides some pre-made shaders for you. Uh, so you got things like for tune shading and cell shading, you got stylized water, outlining effects, and so on. This is from the same people that made Quibbly. So if you need to have more advanced control over it, you can use those two things together. Uh, but Flat Kit just basically makes it quite simple to work with. Again, it comes with predefined stylized water shaders and outline effects and so on. So let's actually see a, a bit of it in action. So you can see the various different renditions you can do and the styles you can come up with. There's one flat art style. It's the exact same thing with a different style and a different style and a different style and yet another style. So again, you got the outline options and so on. So if you want to quickly and easy add that flat shading look to your project, that is what flat kit is all about. This one is regularly 40 bucks. So again, 70% off of that. Next up, we have the Big Castle Kit. This one is a huge collection of assets around the theme of, well, creating a medieval style castle. Probably the easiest way to explain this one is to actually go ahead and show it to you. And this is it. So these are all the various different assets that go together. It is a modular kit, everything you need to create a castle environment, both exterior and interior setup. So let's go ahead and take a look at the showcase. So here you can see is one such castle that was created using these assets right here. So this is the exterior environments you could go ahead and create. Again, since it's modular, they all kind of go together like Lego bricks. You could use this in a procedural creation environment. And if you want interiors, well, you've got that covered as well. So here is another example. And let's go inside of our building. And here you can see you can full out full interiors of your medieval style buildings as well. I believe we have a couple of floors going on here. So if you're trying to create that Skyrim-esque style game, uh, this is for creating interiors and exteriors for uh, castle environments. So that is the big castle kit. $58 normally. Next up, we have Atavism X6. Unfortunately, I can't show you this one hands-on. I have trouble redeeming my key to get it up and running. 
Uh, but this one is for creating MMOs. Also, as you may notice, it's $499. So it's a pretty huge savings as well. And it is a full-blown MMO kit. So you can see here they're doing uh, character creation. You have, um, well, you have a ton, actually. Let's go jump down here, take a look at what kind of stuff is handled here. So you got a database system, an instancing system, an account management system, systems for making mobs and NPCs, loot tables, factions, quests, dialogues, items, socketing, enchanting, item sets, auction house, skills, abilities, effects, uh, stat systems, player to character setup, crafting systems, arena systems, option choice module, game settings module, merchants table, currency module. You, you get the idea at this point. Weather systems, race systems, class systems, uh, guild systems, mailing system, chat systems, server side nav meshes, talents, bonus and so on. So what you get in this package is the server software. You can host anywhere you want. Unlimited active world services up to the CCU limit, CCU being concurrent users. There is a 1,000 player simultaneous connected to the um, server host, like the per server area. So you have 1,000 CCU limit there. Uh, you get the editor for Unity, full demo, and access to their plugin server code with coding knowledge allows you to modify and adjust server side logic. And you're getting a bunch of bonus things as well here, environmental systems, uh, some game ready assets um, to kind of get you up and going, some UI stuff, uh, pathfinding system for atavism, uh, and integrated with a number of other platforms out there. So if you're looking to create an MMO, that is essentially what atavism is. Uh, it is a absolutely huge asset. Uh, unfortunately, it's not really something I can demo to you nicely in just, you know, a couple of minutes like what we've got right here. And again, I had a little bit of problems with my key redemption. So this one we're going to be showing you in the store only. But $4.99, if this is an asset you've had an eye on that's 70% off, potentially 80% off with the code, uh, is a pretty solid savings. Now, our next item isn't actually just one asset. It's a five-in-one collection. This is the world building bundle. And this is way it works is once you own this, you actually can go and get all five of the items listed here. You go to the asset store and they will all be $0 for you to purchase them. So we are consisting of Gaia Pro 2021. This is a really cool application I covered in the past. It is a procedural world generator. You can run through basically a wizard say, I want you to create me uh, this particular kind of biome environment and it will do it for you. Number of different things here, supports for all the major pl uh, platforms out there. Uh, you get water systems, you get uh, modular design, the world designer for fully procedural world generation. Uh, you can convert trains into mesh, uh, tons of functionality here. Basically, you can really just quickly, quickly create these game worlds using uh, procedural generation. Then once you've got that, you can use Gena Pro for populating them. You can use this for creating trains, villages, roads, and rivers within those worlds. Obviously, same company, so these tools work together flawlessly. And then you've got ambient sounds for basically defining soundscapes within those regions. So then you can set up little areas. You could say a forest area to have birds chirping or the wind rustling. Then you could have a desert area with, I don't know, rattlesnakes rattling and so on and so forth. So you can set up these various different soundscapes within your generation world and then you can set up Pegasus. Pegasus is for doing pathing and fly throughs. You can also use it to do um paths that your NPCs will follow through the world. But if you needed to do cutscenes and you want the camera to fly in a certain way through the world, Pegasus does that for you. And then finally, you have Sector. Sector is for cutting up your world into different chunks that can then be streamed. Obviously, Sector works with all of the tools we just talked about here. So you get basically a complete world building kit here. So you've got, again, Gaia for procedurally generating the environment themselves. Gana for populating things. You can create things like, again, villages and roads and such that go in a Gaia thing. Uh, by the way, you can always use these tools separately as well. Sector for cutting it up into different worlds and streaming those out. So you can uh, basically have infinite worlds the data streams in as you need it. Uh, the ambient soundscapes for actually defining sound to live in that world and then Pegasus for doing, you know, camera fly throughs, cutscenes, and that kind of stuff. So the world building bundle is actually five assets in that single bundle, normally $4.99 for the entire pack. And then our final of the day one flash deals is the Polygon Apocalypse by Cinti. This is a collection of low poly 3D models in Cinti style. Now, the nice thing is Cinti has so many assets out there that if you need to fill in the blanks, you don't have everything you need for your game here. You can match the art style and they will have a pack for it. So if you need a zombie pack, they will have a 
zombie pack, and so on. But you're going to find this pack is pretty comprehensive. So if you're making a post-apocalyptic style game, you get an idea of what you're seeing here. So everything is modular. You've got a modular bunker system, modular wall system, uh, attachments, so you can create vehicles with armor attachments and weapon attachments. you got a number of attachments for your characters to create somewhat infinite variety. You see here you've got 30 different characters in the pack and then 86 different attachments, things like armors and beards and hair and so on for those characters. 17 vehicles, 88 vehicle attachments, uh, 30 buildings with interiors, uh, 150 modular building pieces, additional structures, environments, props, items, complete weapons, 86 weapons, 184 weapon modules. Uh, it just kind of goes on and on. Compatible with the ERP, uh, by the way, so Universal Render Pipeline. So you're looking at a total of over 1,800 detailed prefabs in this pack. Now let's go take a look. So if you've never seen um, Cynthia's art style before, it is very uh, nice. I've always been a big fan of it. Um, so if you're looking for a complete art pack, this is probably as robust a pack as you're going to find. And as I mentioned earlier on, they have um, packs for just about everything. So if you need horses, you've got a horse pack out there. If you need um, stores, sci-fi, aliens, zombies, I guarantee you they make a pack containing those things in a very consistent art style. And as you see, these, a lot of these things actually will have interiors and exteriors going on. And they're all basically drag and drop prefabs that are all ready to go. Um, it's a very clean art style. Uh, so let's see, is inside do we have any... Yeah, so see, interior of your diner uh, has everything to find. So if you need to create a post-apocalyptic style world, this pack, again, 1,800 prefabs up and ready to go, uh, including, uh, what was it, 30 plus characters ready to drop in. So this pack is gigantic. And again, uh, there are a decent number of Cynthi assets throughout the sale. So if you want to fill in your collection uh, you can definitely supplement it as well. So that is the um, Cinti Apocalypse Pack. Again, regularly 300 bucks, so 70% off or up to 80% off. Pretty solid savings. And then, of course, on top of that, you have 500 of the most popular items out there, also 50% off. I can't show you them because I'm actually recording this, as you can see, uh, the day before the sale goes live. But you do have the ability to come in, check out all of the sales that are going to be happening. And once again, remember, there is the code uh, Game from Scratch BF 22 to save an additional 10% uh, off everything stacking, so 70% plus 10%. Uh, use it at checkout. So uh, I do like the new format they're going with. There's no FOMO on this one. There's no shock. You know what the entire sale is going to be from beginning to end. Uh, so you can kind of plan accordingly. I also like the fact that they are doing the additional sales for people to spend $100 or more. It's, it's a nice touch. I'm curious what you think of this form factor. I know a lot of people did not like the previous way they did these flash sales. But when you announce everything up front so you know what every sale is going to be, you can plan accordingly. You know you're not going to get screwed if you buy something and then it comes on sale later on there is no real guesswork in this you know exactly what everything was going to be throughout the life of the sale and yeah let me know what you think also thank you to the unity asset store for sponsoring this video and i shall talk to you all later goodbye